All right, welcome back to another edition of Bench Test. Today we're gonna play Friend List. No, wait, that's wrong. There we go. Sonic Boom. That was released after the Nintendo Direct. It was supposed to come out the Tuesday, but whatever. I think they just held it off for that. I you can download it right now. But 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 Tuesday was sooner. Ah oh, well. And mm, no. Okay. And no, I did not play it a bunch of times. You only get eight uses out of the demo. Jeez. I don't understand that logic, but whatever. But anyway, this demo is relatively short. You can do quite a bit. However, in order to show everything off in one sitting, I decided to speedrun it because why the hell not? By complete accident, by the way. So, yeah. Seaside Beach. Seaside Beach. Totally not Seaside Hill. Yeah, that's not a zone either. <laughs> no, they don't. They kind of dropped the zone aspect by, well, way before Genesis even. Seaside Beach just sounds so generic. It's like saying the same thing twice. <laughs> Pretty much. And yeah, maybe they avoid copyright. So with this game, you can actually switch between four characters at will. Between Sonic, Tails, the new character Styx, and Knuckles, who swallowed the Master Emerald and... Well, they got that in product. <laughs> yeah. Yes. Now with Tails, he can play this very weird and unnecessary mini game in which to find a treasure. There are actually a bunch of collectibles that the game tells you with getting. Like, they consider this a treasure. I'm not sure there's an official name for it, but the demo just says treasure, so whatever. There are mm. also five crystals to collect. You need a certain amount of rings by the end of the stage, and out. They want, expect you to beat the stage in a certain amount of time. I think 6 minutes and 40 seconds. Oh, okay. Something like that. It is impossible to do your first times because you're not going to really understand a damn thing, but this is after a few hours of playing because I was actually waiting for a vendor to finish on Vegas before I recorded, so right. I spent the entire time just playing this demo. Were those his tales when he was in that sub? I maybe I don't know if it was him actually, but it could have been something he just built. It's not really that would have been weird and very unnecessary. Just like Sonic, I guess that. If he's just in that boat, I mean, or in that sub, and he's using his own tail, it's like, well, it's, it's, I mean, you've got an air tank in there, maybe, but right. That's pretty neat. It's like yeah. a classic Sonic loop. Yeah, and. Basically making a return from Sonic Lost World is there's actually a run button. Ow, good thing I had a shield. Uh, you press the Y button to start dashing, but you, unlike Sonic Lost World, you don't have to hold it. You just gotta press it once, and once your character starts running, then you can let go of the button. What do you prefer? Uh, this, this, cause my finger doesn't hurt after holding down the button. <laughs> I figured, yeah. Yeah. Now I'm actually skipping a lot of crap, cause again I'm trying to speed run to beat the time, but. There were a few things where I could grab a hold of to swing using the inner beam, like that. But, like I said, I'm trying to save time. There were also enemies with shields, which require you to move with the inner beam, but again, trying to save time. Ain't nobody got time for that. Yeah. Hmm. Uh, this happened so fast, but you, you had to use a touchscreen for that part, right? For fling him. Yeah. Occasionally you'll get, have to fling to a different part of the area, which I guess you could consider Act 2, but the thing is you get fleeing back to the area previously so I don't know what to consider it I guess you could consider them acts but you go back and forth between them it's, it's confusing I know okay yeah <laughs> definitely different yeah oh there it goes that swinging motion now I said earlier that you could switch between characters at any time but this is more of a sonic demo than anything because well right here this is sticks you can use a boomerang to Solve puzzles, and that's the last time we're going to see her in the stage. Oh, five, six. <laughs> yeah, pretty that's much. what I was going to ask actually. I was like, do you use all of them in this? Because there's Sonic as well. I'm seeing. Those. Yeah, the, the thing with it that is, you know, it's all those blue blocks I'm destroying, right? With Sonic's yeah. dash, they're all over the mother truck in place. This is why it's pretty much Sonic's time to shine. And that's really my main problem with this demo, because this is the first time in a good while that the series has multiple characters who pretty much play similar, but have their own attributes to where speed is still the main part of the gameplay. Right. But the demo is just like, eh, 
small sample of everyone, but uh, Sonic's name is in the game, so deal with it. Do you see him the most? Yeah. Yeah, pretty much. But yeah, everyone can dash, everyone can go through loops, everyone pretty much has the same amount of speed. Everyone can do the homing attack for some reason. That's not gonna ask. Say what now? Even Knuckles is fast? Yes, it looks so surreal. <laughs> We're gonna see a little bit of that once we get to his part much, oh. much later. But. Knuckles yeah. Deoxys. Knuckles Deoxys. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Knuckles had to build muscles in 30 days. <laughs> yeah, he's on that Mega Swamper and Ike. Uh... <laughs> <laughs> Mega Swamper and Ike. <laughs> yeah. yeah. We. Dem Demroids. Yes. I just noticed you have a lot of rings. Yeah, I think you need at least 150 to meet the quota. Oh. So I think I'm pretty much good. Yeah. Oh, Tails. Oh, uh, something else different. Tails can't actually fly. He can glide. He glides, okay. But he can't fly. Yeah. I guess it'd be kind of broken if he could. I mean, like, he yeah. could get tired like he did in the original, which would make oh, yeah. sense. Right. But yeah, he's the only one that can use those fans and play that submarine minigame that we saw earlier. Yep. He is. Yeah, he, <laughs> he looks weird when he runs. Yes, but anyway, Knuckles, he can dig through dirt. Pretty much like Yellow Drill from Sonic Colors and Sonic Lost World, and that enemy was in the way. Whatever. <laughs> Oh, something else I'm not showing off, the bottom screen, you can actually switch pages to show off, you know, your submission cat objectives, because you actually don't have to complete all of these, uh, what should we call it, the uh, extra missions. Mm -hmm. You can just get to the end and not worry about it, but I just wanted to show it off because, eh, why not? I'm sure the full game, like... You might get a reward for doing that kind of stuff. Right, like a little right. bonus or something, like, right. hey. Right, I don't think you had to do it all in one go, because the thing is, trying to do everything while still going under the time limit is a very extreme... It's kind of tight. Yeah. It sounds very stressful. <laughs> yes. And that stupid fan kept getting in the way. There we go. Oh, I was wondering what was going on there. Okay. Yeah. Also, every character can double jump. That's hmm. good. Yeah. And that's the end. Oh. Yes, but there's three other levels. See, I, I did everything. Damn. Yeah. I'm sure Damn if you just... <laughs> I'm sure if you just went for the time limit on its own and not everything else, you could probably beat it faster than that, but right. I just wanted to try everything in one go, and I did it. But there are three other levels, and I probably could have cut this out, but the thing is, my the vendor I was talking about earlier took eight hours because, whoops, I goofed. So... Oh. I didn't record it till this morning, and I just kind of shoved the footage in here in Vegas, started the render, and called it a day. <laughs> These graphics actually look really good. Yeah, especially the models. Some of the yeah. visuals kind of look blurry once you run by. I mean, that might have been the point because speed. Mm -hmm. But other than that, yeah, the, model, the models especially, they look very good. Yeah, definitely impressive. Wait, when standing still, split the... Oh. I don't know. Anyway, this is another type of gameplay element. I guess a rival race basically takes cues from Sonic Generations, well, the 3DS version. You just race a rival to the end. There are submissions in this one as well. Beat the time and collect a certain number of rings. I think that's it. Uh, do we ever see sticks again? But Yeah, at the end. Oh, oh, okay. Let's <laughs> say so, you're gonna pass her then. Again, I played this demo for about four hours straight, rain on my render, so I kind of had everything by heart. Mastered it. By complete accident. Good stuff. Quote unquote accident. Mm -hmm. To be fair, I thought only an hour passed before I looked at my clock and realized it was 2 o'clock in the morning. What oh, crap. Yeah, I didn't go to bed till 5. Ooh. Yeah, I decided to keep playing the game. Anyway, just... Well, we saw sticks. She just fell backwards. Yeah. Yeah, I saw that little wob. I was like, what was that? Yeah. Never been it. Yeah. 
What kind of animal is Stick supposed to be? Uh, badger. Oh, no. Yeah, we're getting exotic up in here. She may not give a damn at all. <laughs> I see what you did there. Yeah, jokes. I wonder if that's a meme already. The sticks, oh, anyway. Yeah. Oh. I don't know about sticks, but yeah, I mean, I'm sure someone thought of that. Well, if some oh. if not, trademark me. 2014. Yeah, yeah I'm about to say it. someone's watching this. Oh, see, there she is. She looks very unexcited about her loss. I wonder why. <laughs> She's had a boomerang. I should the, the 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 ring counter. I was like, wait a minute. He passed it. Never mind. <laughs> Yeah, I was like 225, I was 241, I was like, uh, maybe it switched, but nope, dupes yeah. collected coins. Right. For rings. I, did, I okay. actually didn't, it is possible to collect every ring, but I kind of took a shortcut that caused me to miss some rings, so eh. Anyway, there is one more level we can do, and it's actually pretty impressive compared to the other levels in the series. It's actually a mock speed section. Ooh. Yes, introduced in Sonic 06. <laughs> what? Oh god. I just noticed that it doesn't in the intro. It doesn't say Sega. Nope. I was somewhat disappointed, actually. Yeah, maybe they'll do that in the Wii U version. Who knows? Who knows? Yeah. Speaking of <laughs> speaking, <laughs> his legs. Yeah. Speaking of Wii U version, apparently the demo's not coming out till after the game is released. Uh. Yay, logic. I mean, uh -huh. it's it's happened before. Yeah, like Pikmin three. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, that that that's yeah. a gears, but um. Yep. So anyway, with box speed section, you automatically run forward, and you can actually hold down the X button or was it Y? I don't remember. But you can dash infinitely. But the thing is, you can't move left and right while dashing. Oh. Okay. So you got to stop, like I'm doing right now. And I was gonna say, I was like, it seems like you're doing that now. Right. I. Going to assume you lose rings if you hit those electrical obstacles. I don't know. Never hit them. All I know is the red. Mm, well, it's too late now. Yeah. And also, the ring quota is you have to collect every ring on this path. Did you already use your eight tries? Uh, no, because again, when I when I was playing the game for a few hours straight, it was on the first. Try. <laughs> <laughs> you should waste one of your tries and get back to us if it, they do hurt you. Um, well... Logic. Eh. But yeah, that's really all this demo really amounts to these three levels. It's enjoyable for the most part. It's, it takes some getting used to because it's, well... A, I wouldn't say a major departure from the traditional Sonic formula, but it's definitely different. Right. And I will also warn Sonic fans that if you're expecting a traditional Sonic game, uh, you're going to be disappointed. I did see that Sega was like, this is Sonic Boom is going to be like its own thing, and then there's going to be, you know, main Sonic games, I guess you could say. Right. Because this is definitely then, geared towards a different audience. Yeah. Now the Animal Hunt, are we going to show for this? Uh, this week weekend, actually. Yep. Oh, wow. Yeah. I actually just saw merchandise of last week. Uh -huh. There was like, plushes and stuff like that yeah i just saw that but yep that's all this demo amounts to i plan on getting this day one along with the wii version sonic boom sonic boom really wish they released a demo for the wii version before the release date but eh what can you do yeah that would have been cool to watch yeah but oh, those two whales but yeah final thoughts y'all uh actually that demo looked pretty impressive I don't know if I'm getting the game, but it, it definitely looks pretty fun. It looks fun, I'll be honest, but I probably won't get it. Because I'm not that big of a Sonic fan, I guess, so... But it looks nice. Yeah. I'll probably watch you play it if you do record it. Same. <laughs> Is that day one recording? Yeah! <laughs> you heard it here. Thanks, game. Oh. So you automatically die if you hit the red things. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Confirmed. <laughs> well, thanks for letting us know. <laughs> yeah, I'm. The demo might have been open on my 3DS while we were recording. Just, just yeah, yeah. But yeah, James, James, did you have any thoughts on this? <laughs> oh, I'm not a Sonic fan either, but it did. It did look nice. Yeah. 
But yeah, that is it for this bench test. We will see y'all next time. Thank you for watching, and we'll see you then. Later. Bye. There's a lesson here. Don't do steroids like Knuckles. <laughs>